And two videos in, we're already changing the set. Good morning, everyone. It's Tuesday. I woke up early Sunday, and my friend Tyler and I loaded up his car and got ready for the long drive back to Denver. As we left the neighborhood I grew up in, I began to think of what the idea of home means to me. Minneapolis had always been the place I thought of as home, and going home had always been special to me. Even with big changes in the city, I still feel at home when I go back to Minnesota. But why is that? I haven't really lived in Minnesota in two and a half years. I've lost touch with many of my Minnesota friends and more than half the people who live on my block are now people I don't know. Other than my love for my hometown, the one thing keeping me tied to Minnesota in the present is my family. This seems to be the key. My family and my memories are what make Minnesota feel like home to me. But as we continued our drive south, I knew there had to be more to the idea of home. For the first time, I'd begun to refer to my trip from Minneapolis to Denver as going home. When had this happened? When had I begun to think of Denver as my home too? I have lived in Denver for almost three years now, and have built significant connections and relationships in my time out here. Interestingly, it would seem that the old saying, home is where the heart is, seems to apply here. I was sadder than I thought I would be when I wasn't able to be home on Christmas Day for the first time in my life, which was what had prompted my consideration of home. Perhaps home is more than a geographical or physical place, but instead deals with an idea or a feeling. Missing home had more to do with missing being... Long though, and we ended up at a grocery store before I took over at the wheel. I only managed to capture this footage while I was driving. Pro tip, don't vlog and drive. I didn't get anything after the stop until complete and utter darkness. The camera couldn't even differentiate here between inside and outside the car. I actually filmed by my feet for about 10 seconds. You're not even looking outside till right about now. But we continued our trip, with the road slowly but surely bringing us back toward Denver. And as the headlights illuminated our path, I began to feel more comfortable with my understanding of home. I didn't need to feel wary about my changing reality. Denver didn't need to feel different or even feel like a second home. It could function simply as home. I'll see you on Friday. Man, why can't everything just unpack itself?